Episode 226, Purpose Over Profit. You're listening to the very best podcast in the world on health, wealth, and happiness. Please remember to leave a review and share with all your friends and family. And here is your host, Lars Hilson. And we are back with Bat Noise <laughs> on the very best podcast in the world, the only source in the universe for personal supremacy through health, wealth, and happiness. Now, for some reason, there is some kind of audio issue, which I haven't been able to figure out, but it still sounds feasible enough to uh, actually record this until I have more time tonight to uh, figure out what the technicalities of this problem are to then solve it. Uh, no, otherwise, we wouldn't have an episode today, which would be disastrous. And uh, we don't want that. So, <laughs> uh, in that sense, uh, a few things before we get started. Uh, housekeeping-wise, um, I've used my own, blah. Uh, number two on the items checklist is that um, uh, sharing is caring. And uh, so uh, if this or any other episode, uh, you know, is, ex is uh, uh, exceedingly valuable uh, to you or has been so to your life, please make sure to share it with other people in your sphere of influence. Uh, and make sure to share these episodes far and wide because I'm, you know, upon my f the feedback that I got last or the week before last um, was very positive in that somebody wrote me, hey, you know, a friend of mine sent this to me uh, or I found this in the social feed of a friend of mine and it just uh, changed my life so much that, you know, sharing this uh, content uh, is just insanely valuable. Um, you know, uh, David, our, uh, the guy who lent the voice, uh, to uh, to the intro um, has made the point, but I keep on repeating it just because uh, this podcast is having more uh, positive impact than I anticipated when I when I started it out. So uh, that being said, today's episode is uh, going to be brief as well. Should be should have been another housekeeping item, still construction, you know, major rehaul on a variety of fronts, and it just doesn't stop. And uh, so episode's going to be short, and it is based on a quote that uh, is uh, or that was attributed to uh, Richard Branson, who supposedly said, uh, "The brands that will thrive in the coming years are the ones that have." purpose beyond profit and uh, i kind of altered uh, the quote a little bit uh, simply to uh, to make the point that you know anything that is successful and therefore you know in some way profitable um, has a purpose and if we look at the brands that do the most successful ones that are out there currently are those you know that let's take an apple for instance uh, not an apple but the apple uh, you know what i'm talking about right the iphone guys um, you know and uh, as someone who's been dealing with operating systems all of their lives you know apple just proves to be the one that is uh, that has the most purpose it's the most usable uh, you know it's the most accessible it's the easiest to use for a lot of people and uh yeah they you know have their price tag to it but you know so be it it's the most valuable uh company in the world now um purpose over profit getting back to the title of this episode um uh, and i deliberately called it that because profit doesn't necessarily uh have to be only monetarily right it's uh what you do right does it have a purpose and is it profitable for you uh you know this can be like this podcast, something that's rather altruistic, right? Uh, in that, you know, I, I don't have advertising on here and I don't intend to do so. Uh, for me, it's um, really sharing my experience with other people and uh, experience I have just a tremendous, tremendous amount of. And uh, in the past, and that was the reason for uh, starting the podcast in the first place, was uh, feedback that I got from people that, you know, kind of joined my sphere of influence. And, you know, we got into polite conversation and 
a lot of them said, you know, look, you have, you've been through so much in your life, you know, that's worth sharing just for other people to uh, not make the same mistakes you made or to get motivated, you know, by your, uh, you know, coming from, well, not nothing, but, you know, <laughs> coming from, uh, you know, without a degree to, you know, being a, being a highly paid consultant, you know, yes, I have degrees, but I don't have any, any, you know, majors or masters or, you know, whatever, like, you know, high academia degrees. Right. Uh, but that's the point. Uh, the, the point is that, you know, the profit of this podcast for me, uh, has been the feedback uh, that I got, you know, from which I mentioned in the introduction and, uh, thereby, you know, being, uh, being able to help people. And that's the purpose in that equation. And, uh, so, you know, again, yeah, you might argue that the profit is set into this quote, uh, to only be interpreted as monetarily, but that's not true, you know, because it says purpose over profit. And uh, I think, you know, the profit uh, in itself will come by itself if you offer, uh, you know, a uh, something that is purposeful to other people, you know, be it volunteer work uh, where, you know, you can just meet interesting people and it's exciting, you know, getting back to uh, my decades in, in the voluntary fire department or, you know, a lot of other things that are just totally exciting and um, serve a purpose. And the profit itself, be it monetary, be it, be it monetary or not, comes as a byproduct. You know, uh, fire department wise, I just learned so much. Uh, you know about technical aspects of of uh, everything. You know, how does an engine work? And you know, there, there were detail. There were people there that really took time to explain all of the gear and everything. You know, and you learn just so much about. You know, <laughs> when you have a building fire, you inevitably learn a lot about buildings, right? And you know how materials burn. Is that it's just interesting to know. You know, so the profit in that case was anything but monetary because I invested time, right? And but at the the profit was, you know, learning. And so don't uh, ever, you know, slim, uh, slim down the word profit to a uh, dollar sign or euro sign or yen sign or whatever it is at the end of the day that your local currency is right. Profit can be so much more and, uh, so much more exciting than only having money in your hand, which let's face it, you know, a lot of us exchange for, for stupid shit at the end of the day. Right. So, um, in that sense, I hope I was able to make sense <laughs> for, for this rather brief episode. And, uh, yeah, I hope that you'll join me again tomorrow. Uh, I'm actually I'm quite sure, uh, cause tomorrow we're going to have a, uh, another interesting, uh, very interesting episode actually that we're going to look into the title of which, uh, I haven't really nailed down yet. Uh, but in that sense, I hope you have a nice rest of your Monday and, uh, for those of you who have already had that rest of your Monday, have a good night. Leave your hands above the blanket and we'll be in touch tomorrow, folks. Peace out. Take care. Bye-bye.